So, yeah. Right. Welcome to Bali Icon Scala platform. Sergio Bernal is our guest today. Thank you very, very much, Sergio, for finding time to speak to us, to answer our questions. Of course, you are a very special and one of our very favorite artists, and you took part in the Bali Icon Scala on several occasions, and everyone was such a success. And uh, we are very, very grateful you are today. Thank you, Arya. Thank you. Thank you for all. Thank you for your support. Thank you. Thank you for all. Thank you. Thank you, Olga. It's a real pleasure. I miss you. I um, will start um, our conversation with the first traditional question we ask many of your colleagues now. Yeah. How is your everyday life in this difficult, new, for all of us, lockdown situation? How is your daily routine? How are you managing uh, to be trained? And uh, what processes you're going through now, every day? Yes. Well, my day routine uh, behind with, uh, with a little strength class, you know, because it's very important for, the, for our body. And then I do the, the ballet class, a full ballet class, because it's very important to keep the the technique and the and the body in in this moment and for to come back to 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 the studio to to the stage and and after i have to uh, a little uh, abdominal class for to keep the, the body and a little rehearsal of the choreographies and and you know for the, for the next uh, for the next step and also and now we are study uh, i am study uh, a little theater, uh, theater a production course in the in the university because i think it's this very fantastic important because uh, yes. this leads me to my second question okay uh, if you learned and yes. you started to learn something new in in this period because many say that during the lockdown you have a little bit uh, more time to to reflect and to learn new things please tell yes. us about uh, about this yes no, I am studying uh, a new theater production course because I think it's very important to 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 the dancers, to to our our career, uh, to know what happened in the states, what happened in the backstage, uh, who is the director, who is the the stage director, the stage manager, and and I think it's very important to to take uh, the, the 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 you know the different things. For, for our career, no? I think this is very important. Of course, well, um, wonderful. And I'm sure, I'm sure this new knowledge and experience will bring yes. uh, wonderful things to you as an artist, to your uh, life. And yes, and I think it's very important to, to, to take, also to give uh, your, another vision, no? To develop uh, yourself in a, way, in, in a better way. For, for your career. I think it's very important in, the, in this moment. Definitely. And of course, you being a very, very talented uh, dancer and being a very creative person, you, you can uh, put your, your talents and your creativity into learning. Um, Thank you, my dear. It could bring uh, amazing um, results. Thank you. Uh, what uh, would be your biggest lesson you've learned from uh, this time this lockdown period uh, yeah i think passion patience i think so because i think i am very nervous person and and i like to do things now now patience, and, patience but yeah. yes patience i think but this moment has taught me uh, that not everything is in our hand in our hands but now we have to wait we have to, to, to keep the, the mind and we have to be patient. Uh, I think it's, for me, it's the very important in this moment, I think. And of course, love. This moment, there's at this time when, when we are separated from our family, from uh, our friends and our people we love. Uh, I think it's very important to enjoy, to enjoy every day uh, the, the people that you love, no? I think it's very important, and this is a, a, a great lesson, great lesson on this moment. Because you, you are in the country, in, in Spain, which was hit uh, yes. so, so badly, and the lockdown had so many yes, heavy because, things. And yes, because in Spain, we can, we can go to, to, to the street, we can go, only for to buy uh, eat, to buy something, a little something, no? 
and and this is mm, a little a little a, a little complicated moment i think so yes, of course very very difficult what yes. would be your uh, For all. of course what would be your dream uh, project uh, role which you would like to do as soon as possible as soon as things will come back to normal of course uh, dance I think just dance, uh, a dream. Particular, particular number, which particular role? Um, yeah, 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 no. Uh, I think the first is to continue with uh, the creation of a, a, a foundation in London to make the production that I have uh, spent years working with uh, my director, Ricardo, Ricardo Cue, you know, you know, oh, of course, much. yes. Uh, because we are work and we are waiting, so we are working uh, a production of uh, Ipsalo, the designer, and this is my 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 dream, my my dream. I I, I love this uh, this work. Yeah, this dream to to become true as soon as possible. Yes, 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 yes. As soon as possible. I think it's soon, a very soon. Yes, I think so. And should project and be very very positive about this you are a very passionate spanish yes. man dancer uh, do you feel that you are completely completely spanish when it comes to dance or you can say you have other influences influence of other schools uh, ballet and dance schools or you think well, spanish overtaking Yes, well, my, my behindings uh, were totally flamenco, no? But uh, when I grew up, I could see the importance of ballet in the dance, and I began, and I behind uh, to feel ballet as one of my priorities, no? I think the ballet, the, 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 classical, ba the classical ballet every day is the priority for any style. I think so. I think it's uh, the ballet, I think it's uh, very important to keep the dance and I think for me is the priority. I love flamenco, I love Spanish dance, but I think the, the you're ballet- You're amazing, you're absolutely amazing when you're on the stage doing flamenco. No, 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 but I love classical ballet. I think so, the ballet is very important. Thank you very much. Uh, who, uh, which choreographers, contemporary choreographers would you uh, name whose work you admire uh, from yes. contemporary leading uh, choreographers of today? Well, uh, I think one of my modern choreographers at the moment is uh, Justin Peck. You know Justin Peck? He's a choreographer in, in the New York City Ballet and he does also musical, but uh, I think uh, he has um, a light move movement the people he in, on the stage, and and I think uh, he keeps uh, a little balancing es essence, and I think uh, he is one of the best for me. And also, I love the flamenco and Rocío Molina. Uh, she is uh, one of the one of the best that, uh, bailaora in in the world, and for me also is is great uh, great choreographer at the moment. Fantastic. And of course, so. you, you've been working very, very much with uh, Ricardo yes. Cui and you've been beautifully performing his choreography on several occasions in London. In, in yes. London. Yes, also. Uh, no, Ricardo is one of the best also, for supuesto. He's one of the best and I, he's my, my, my friend, is my, my father, is, is my director and, you know, Ricardo for me is one of the best. Did you find sometimes, uh, of course, being being a very good uh, friend, but when you do his choreography and when he's uh, training and guiding you, do you find yes. uh, it can be sometimes difficult and demanding when he is trying to tell you about every step? And yes, yes, really. Process? Is it very demanding yes. and sometimes can be hard? Yes, it's very, yes, really. Yes, it's very demanding. Yes. But I, I know personally that he so much adores what you're doing with his choreography <laughs> that it's yes, with like like the Swan, like the Swan, or other choreographies. Uh, the last encounter is beautiful, and I think the next year I I will do the the the, the last encounter. It's a beautiful piece. It's one parade, and it's a uh, this is love, this is passion, passion, and will be amazing. I think so. I, I hope. 
we cannot wait for this uh, for this number to be performed in London. Of course, we really yes. we have great great expectations. Yes. Uh, how did you feel when you first uh, danced the the Swan uh, with the choreography by by Ricardo? Uh, because it was in a way revolutionary um, step for a man to do a Swan, which usually is done by women. Uh, pues I, I feel I feel uh, when I when I uh, when I want o sea, when I I'm in the states I feel to be alone in the world because this is the last moment in the in, in your life is the die and I think this is the, the one of the moment in alone in the world I think it's it's very emotional very special very very passion. And I think it's one of the pieces uh, more strong for, for my hair when I dance. Well, yes. when you're doing this choreography, it's just absolutely... Uh, and the choreography is amazing. The, it's so beautiful, so beautiful. Yes, really. And I thanks from Ricardo because uh, his choreography is amazing. The music is so beautiful. And I think it's one of the best. And Maya, please, Skaya, with her dial, that is one. And also Uliana Lopatkina, amazing. Many dancers. Of course, of course. Well, we, we love you doing this number. It's something really out of this world. Um, you, I believe, uh, started thinking about choreography yourself. And we very much hope that soon we will be able to, to see your choreography. How did it start? When did it start? How did it start? And what you're projecting? Uh, well, uh, I'm, I'm start um, five years ago, I think so. Five years ago, yes. But um, for me, the most important in the choreography, I think, is, the, is to move the people to move the heart of the people, I think. No steps, no movement of the people in the stage. I think for me, in the choreography, I think is, is to take the, the heart of the, of the audience and to go another place. I think this, for me, is this the most important, like choreographer and like a dancer. And it is my way for, of creating, you know? I don't create, Choreography, I create emotion. For me, this is... Beautifully, beautifully said. Beautifully said. The, for me, is the most important. I think so. And now we are, work, we are working, Ricardo and I, uh, in the, in the Salogan production. And I think it's very beautiful because we are uh, talking about the, his life, his, uh, the life of uh, Salogan with uh, his, his costume. And I think it uh, will be... So beautiful, so beautiful. Absolutely. I hope, I hope. I have no doubt it will be very beautiful and we just want um, things to, to be normal as soon as possible so you can progress with this uh, exciting project and of course to see it yes. in London and uh, everywhere else. I hope. Of course. Um, what do you find the most difficult in dance when you are dancing? Technically, or on the emotional level, what is the most challenging, the most difficult when actually you, you're producing your performance? Well, the technique is very complicated to, to, uh, to do every day, no? Because in the stage, uh, I am very nervous. But I think the most important, or for me, the most complicated is, is, is the spiritual moment. I think it's, it's the, the very complicated because every day you have to connect with the people to move the, the herd. And for me, I think this is the most complicated. I think so. I think so. Because okay. every day we have to work the tandu, the pirouette, the turales, you know. Exactly. You have to, to go through so many technicalities, but yes. after all, but the most yes, important to, the emotion, yes. Yes, yes. I think this is the very complicated. This is very complicated. Well, Sergio, thank you so, so much for being with us today, for answering our questions. Uh, we need to thank you so much for you. Very, very, very positive. And we need to be patient, as yes. you, as you yes. said. 
we all Very important. To, be, to be a patient and accept uh, what we have at the moment. But of course, take this time as a positive moment to, to reflect, to improve and to project uh, for, for the future. We so much want to meet you on many occasions to work with you. And Thank you, Olga. Thank you so <laughs> much for all to keep, to keep the dance, to keep the arts in London, in, 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 the, in the world. And thank you for your words, because for me it's very important and really thank you. Well, we thank you and as you know, we- Thank you, it's a pleasure to be, to be here with you. Thank you so much again for joining us thank uh, today, Sergio. Thank you so much and see you very soon. We'll see you very, very soon, Sergio. <laughs> thank you again, bye-bye. Very soon, thank you, bye-bye. Bye-bye.